Welcome to this video on the application of geographic information systems in risk assessment. In today's world, risk assessment is an essential aspect of decision making in various fields. GIS has emerged as a powerful tool in risk assessment and management. GIS technology is useful in integrating and analyzing large volumes of spatial data, which helps in identifying, assessing, and managing risks associated with natural disasters, environmental hazards, and other threats. GIS in Risk Assessment GIS technology offers many benefits in risk assessment. One of the primary benefits is its ability to analyze spatial data, which helps identify vulnerable areas and populations. GIS technology also offers visual representation of the data, making it easier to understand and analyze. Furthermore, GIS provides a platform for sharing information across various stakeholders, making collaboration more accessible and effective. Examples of GIS in Risk Assessment Let us look at some examples of GIS applications in Risk Assessment. Natural Disaster Risk Assessment GIS technology can be used to map and analyze areas that are at risk of natural disasters such as earthquakes, floods, hurricanes, and wildfires. By analyzing historical data, GIS can help in predicting the likelihood of a disaster occurring, identifying vulnerable areas and populations, and developing emergency response plans. Environmental Risk Assessment GIS can be used to assess and manage environmental risks such as contamination of soil, water, and air. GIS helps in identifying sources of contamination, tracking the movement of pollutants, and evaluating the potential impacts on human health and the environment. Infrastructure Risk Assessment GIS can be used to assess the risk of failure or damage to critical infrastructure such as transportation networks, power grids, and communication systems. GIS technology can help in identifying vulnerabilities, prioritizing maintenance and repair, and developing contingency plans in case of disruptions. Health Risk Assessment GIS can be used to analyze the spatial distribution of health-related data such as disease outbreaks, hospital admissions, and environmental exposures. GIS helps in identifying patterns and trends, identifying high-risk areas and populations, and developing targeted interventions. Implementation of GIS in Risk Assessment Implementing GIS in Risk Assessment involves several steps. The first step is to identify the data needed for analysis, such as environmental or geographical data. The next step is to collect the data and organize it in a way that can be analyzed by GIS. The third step is to analyze the data using GIS tools and techniques, such as geospatial modeling, spatial analysis, and map creation. Finally, the results of the analysis are used to develop strategies and plans for managing and mitigating risks. In conclusion, geographic information systems are a valuable tool in risk assessment and management. They provide decision makers with powerful spatial information that can help in developing effective strategies to mitigate and manage risks. With the increasing availability of data and the advancement of GIS technology, the application of GIS in risk assessment will continue to grow and play a crucial role in decision-making processes. Thank you for watching this video on the application of geographic information systems in risk assessment.